Hi everybody, it's Amy with Heart and Home Orlando and today we are out here in Claremont, Florida at a David Weekly community called Johns Lake Landing. So this community is really beautiful. Now they've already, gosh, they're already in phase three, getting ready to open up phase four. And I believe I saw there's gonna be a phase five and a phase six. So you've got a lot of opportunities still in this community if you would like to build. However, what I'm standing in right now is an absolutely stunning Wayland Inventory Home here ready and waiting for you. Not only is it here ready and waiting right now, it's close to the entrance of the community. By the way, this location of this entire community is wonderful as far as proximity to shopping and everything else that you're gonna want or need, but wait until you see the view from the backyard of this home. Okay, so let's go over this floor plan. So this floor plan's five bedrooms, three and a half baths, masters on the first floor, major kids central upstairs, awesome floor plan. Not only that, it's 3,506-ish square feet, and again, what a gorgeous home. So the home that I'm standing in is the one that is for sale at the moment. So let's take a look at some of the design features that are chosen. And I want you to also walk through this home with me and think about this as a floor plan for you. Okay, so you've come in through the front door. Over here to our left is your formal living room. Really big, beautiful lighting fixture. You've got crown molding here. And again, this is right off of the entrance as soon as you've come in the front door. Take a look at the flooring because you have a really nice, a dark wood plank flooring Beautiful contrast with that crisp white baseboard, the, uh, the molding down at the bottom, as well as the walls, which are tinted with uh, almost like a little bit of a, of a, a beige-ish gray. It's really beautiful. Now over here to the right, right over here you have, um, you can use this as an office if you want to use it as a living room or a sitting area, you can. But what I like about it is you have the privacy if you want to shut these French doors. Glass pane French doors, by the way, beautiful. Again, right over here, off across from the dining room. If you need office space, this is ideal. If you just need an extra space for whatever else you need, it's nice to have that private zone. Now, coming back this way, you've got the main hub of the home. Take a look at this because, wow, when you get through here and you see what I see, this is amazing. So you have this dark wood here stain and you have your iron spindles or iron balusters. Really, really beautiful. And all of this big open space here in the main hub of your home. You have a lot of square footage, nice, big, open, high ceilings. And then look at all of that railing up there. This is something that a lot of my buyers are looking for, this big, open, massive, really spectacular visual appeal here in this home. So take a look at this kitchen, man. This kitchen is gorgeous. I really like things that are unique and interesting. I like curves, I like angles, and this kitchen is really cool, one of my favorites. It's a big, massive island, but what I like about it is it's kind of cut off here at an angle. It's really nice, it's a great, unique space. It's a, honestly, I think it's a nice little conversation piece right here in the middle of your kitchen. I also like the pendant lights that are already there. Remember, this is an inventory home, so this home is here ready and waiting for you. And look at this beautiful, beautiful granite that you have, really stunning. It's got uh, tans, creams, whites, like almost browns and a deep green in there too. It's really stunning, really beautifully coordinated with the cabinets, by the way, which are a big, beautiful, uh, crisp, white and you also have your um, brush nickel hardware. You have your nice big sink, you've got your gourmet kitchen over here, you've got the window behind the sink which I love and then you have over here your breakfast nook area. Now this breakfast nook area, are you getting a hint of what's back behind me? Are you getting a peek of that water back there? Don't look yet. Okay so here is your <laughs> Here is your, um, your breakfast, your informal dining area. So not only do you have this big, beautiful window right here where you can really soak in the views of John's Lake back behind you, but you also have these doors that you can slide and keep open as well. Wow, this is just a really great floor plan. So over here is your main family room area. A lot of space here as well. And you know what architecturally I really like about this? I like that ledge that goes all the way up and around and that big massive window up top. I really think this is spectacular. It gives you a really unique feel architecturally here in this home. And I'm already thinking, what would I do to decorate up there? Anyway, but it's not my house, it's gonna be your house. So let's take a look real quick because this is important. This outdoor space is really 
really one of a kind. It's beautiful. So not only do you have the view, but you have this covered lanai space out here, this, this patio out here in the back, covered, beautiful. Not only is it just covered, but they've even done special treatment here up to the top, which is really beautiful. A nice little touch there, David Weekly Homes. But what I like about this, by the way, did you notice it's um, pre-wired pre over there if you want to do a summer kitchen? It's already pre-wired or pre-plumbed for you over there. But then take a look at this. You can go down here. Wow, this is beautiful. You have so much space here in the yard. So not only do you have the conservation view that's back behind you all around here, but you have a massive unobstructed view there of John's Lake as well. This is beautiful. Serene, you hear the birds chirping. This is really beautiful. And with all of this quiet and serenity, you wouldn't know that you've got like Target, like three minutes away from you. <laughs> so this is what I like about this community and this location. Because for me, I like this feel, but I've still got to be close to like civilization and shopping. And this is really a great location here located in Claremont, Florida. So do you agree? Is this already so amazing with this view and that, I mean, seriously. Now real quick, before we go back inside and finish up the rest of the home, I want you to take a peek just beyond the water. You might see like the fresh dirt and you might even see some of the construction vehicles. Um, so that's what's happening over there is there's additional phases of this community. This community is still growing more and more and more homes, probably another 200 or so homes that are going to be able to be built in that section. But here you are right here looking at them being built while you're enjoying the view. All right, so let's go back inside and let's finish up. Now remember, this, um, this floor plan has the master on the first floor, 3,506 square feet, so there's a lot of space, right? So in, uh, in here, you're gonna have your master on the first floor and then again, Kid Central upstairs. So back over here, tucked away, you have a lot of fun stuff. So you have your entry to your garage is back behind me. If you want to take a peek at the garage, I did not open the door yet, but let's do that. Some people really like the garage. So it's a three car garage. So you have a two bay door and then a single bay, but it is all open and connected, which is really nice. So you have a lot of space. You'll notice it already has the garage door openers as well. You know, and that may seem really silly, but I cannot tell you how many people go, oh, I didn't realize the garage door opener doesn't come with the home. Most builders, it doesn't. It's something you have to add in. So over here, immediately, as soon as you enter in through the garage, to the left is your laundry room. So not only do you have the laundry room here ready for your hookup with the washer and dryer, you have your shelving, but you've got this great folding table. But this is really cool because I'm already thinking of like my pets and what a cute little spot, spot that would be for, you know, cats or dogs, little dog bed, you know, little decoration there on the wall. I think it's super cute. And then tucked away back over here too is your little powder bath. So this is, again, it's nice. You know, people uh, like, you obviously need the powder bath here on the first floor, um, but it's nice that it's kind of over here tucked away and nice and private. So down in this direction, again, this wood flooring has continued in this entire direction. So back behind, oh, we don't want to forget the cubbies. You're right, cubbies, cubbies, don't forget the cubbies. So as you come in, you've got this nice little drop zone here. Great spot to kick off those shoes, hang that backpack, purse, briefcase, whatever it is, leave that there. And then come back into your retreat. So this is the master bedroom. What a big, beautiful master bedroom this is. A lot of square footage, nice tall ceilings. And you see that it has the crown molding all the way around as well. Really, really beautiful. Now the carpet in here is like a gray. It's really beautiful. The color scheme that they've chosen for this home really is really, really beautiful. Now, something interesting with this floor plan is that behind me is the door to the closet, but this is a door here, but there's also a door from the bathroom. So this is kind of unique, really smart, really interesting. So you have this opportunity here and you can see that we'll just, we'll just go around. We're just gonna go into the bathroom the opposite way. So we come back this way and now you're into the master bathroom. So this is a really big, beautiful master bathroom. I really like that they have this big massive shower right here. And you know, they really have done a just an absolutely stunning idea with the design options. So not only do you have this beautiful flooring, now this is a different flooring than what we've seen, so take a moment and take a look at it. Really beautiful. And then take a look at the flooring that they've continued here into the actual shower. And then the floor that they've continued up the wall. But that's not, that's not they're not done because then they have a separate tile insert here absolutely beautiful i really really love this and then if you take a look at the countertop it's beautiful now you have your dark gray cabinets you've got beautiful hardware really interesting i like how they did like the little um kind of like the crystal knobs here and the reason i think that's beautiful is because if you can't tell in the video this countertop is sparkling there are little bits of like an iridescent 
uh, shimmer in there. It's almost like a glitter inside this countertop and it's beautiful. So really did a nice job picking out all the design choices for this. Of course, you've got the privacy door for the toilet as well. You've got a linen closet and again, that seriously awesome master closet. Okay, so that's the first floor here of this Waitland floor plan, but there's still a lot more to see upstairs. I'm gonna take a breath, I'll meet you up there. So as you're looking at that incredible view, I'm gonna finish making my way up this quite grand staircase up into the real fun zone. So upstairs you've got four bedrooms, two full baths, and this incredible flex space or game room space. Again, if you just, in a minute, you're gonna take a look out that window because it's just beautiful. This entire area, you know, Claremont, um, is like one of the highest points elevation wise here in central Florida. And so Claremont gives you something that, you know, some of the other areas around here doesn't, you kind of get a little bit of more of a rolling hill effect and it's really kind of beautiful. So continuing on with this floor plan, the Wayland floor plan at 3,506 square feet, you have this massive game room space upstairs. Perfect because it's located right off of the staircase, nice and open, big windows to take in that view. You have these closets here, great place to store those board games or any other toys um, that you know you and your friends and your family might have. Now remember, this is four bedrooms. So these first two bedrooms located here and here are gonna be connected by Jack and Jill. So let's come on in here. Now this one's, these two bedrooms are located, actually three of the bedrooms, but this one specifically is located here at the front of the home. So over here you have a nice, you know, it's a very nice size bedroom, big bedroom. You have a nice big walk-in closet as well. You have this window here so you can see that this one is located here at the front of the home. It's connected with the other bedroom by this Jack and Jill. And I like this because you, um, you share this area right here and then you have, you know, your toilet and your tub back over here. So it's, it's almost not a true Jack and Jill as much as it, they both share this bathroom. Totally okay, how nice is it to have like a bathroom that's kind of private. So here's the second of those bedrooms. Again, really nice, comparable in size, big beautiful window, gorgeous view out the front. And again, you have a nice big closet. So continuing to come in here, and I really cannot stress this enough. This is something that's very difficult to get. It's just that view every day when you come out of the bedroom, that's what you get to see is that beautiful, beautiful view of John's Lake. Continuing on down the hallway over here, another reason that I like just architecturally, I love this. I love that this looks down to the foyer area. I think it just really opens everything up as though it needs to be any more open, but it's just kind of beautiful. You have additional railing. This all just ties in and it really makes such a dynamic visual statement. So back over here, we have another bedroom. Now this one feels like, I'm not looking at the floor plan, this one feels like it might be a little bit bigger than the other two. Not 100% sure, but it is nice size bedroom. You have that big double window over there. So let's go from corner to corner so you can kind of see the amount of space you've got, right? This is nice. You have this nice big double closet over here as well. And then right outside of this door, you have a bedroom across the hall, but you also have this bedroom, or bathroom, sorry. You have another bathroom over here. So this is the bathroom if you had friends and family hanging out, hanging out in the game room and you were playing. So I need to use restroom. This would be the restroom that they use. Now, if you come back over here, we have yet another bedroom. Also feels like this one's a little bit bigger even than the other one. So bedrooms seem to be getting bigger and bigger in size over here. So this one, oh man, this one is amazing because whoever gets this lucky room, not only gets the additional square footage, but look at the view that that person gets. So this might be the perfect opportunity if you do have kids that need to be fighting over these rooms. This might be the perfect way to start to get them to like uh, shape up, you know, and get them themselves, get those chores done, all that kind of stuff so that they can like draw the big straw to get this uh, room. So not only that, I want to point out this has a nice big walk-in closet as well, like a true actual walk-in closet. But the other thing that makes this bedroom a little bit more unique is that back behind me, you have the other, um, you have the other bath, the entrance to this bathroom. So right over here, you have that same bathroom that we saw out in the hall. They have a connection right here. So kind of cool. They get their own little doorway. All right. So let's wrap up this video. This home will not be here long. This is the Wayland floor plan. This home that I'm in right now is an inventory home. It is here. It is ready and waiting for you. So if you were looking for a move here to Florida, to this area in the next month, I won't even say two months because I don't think the home will be here that long. But if you are looking to move here quickly, finding a home that is ready, here's the thing. It's new. It's brand new. It comes with that builder's warranty. No one's lived in this home. You can make it yours. And boy, do they give you a gorgeous palette for you to kind of put your own little bit of spice into this home. So 3,506 square feet. It's the Wayland floor plan here at Johns Lake Landing by David Weekly Homes. If you are interested in this home or if you want more information about 
information, there we go, about this builder or this community, just give me a call at 407-848-8042. Remember, I don't represent the builder. I'm a realtor here trying to help you as you're looking for a possible move here to this area. I wanna show you the builders and the different floor plans and the different opportunities that you have here to make this part of Florida your home. This is really a gorgeous find. I hope you like it. Give me a call, 407-848-8042. I hope to make this house your home. Have a great day and happy house hunting.